Today we are decorating for Christmas. It's a super quick video. I did a time lapse of everything that I did. I actually decorated, it was the weekend after Thanksgiving, but now that we are in December and where I live, we have gotten a few small little snow showers, if that's the right way to put that. Um, so I figured now would be a perfect time to post this. I went ahead and I vacuumed and cleaned up the entire living room before I started, got the tree put up, and then I realized half of my colored lights did not light up after I strung them around the tree. I had tested them not too long ago, so I'm not sure why they decided to work, not work in these past couple of weeks since I tested them, but I had strung the entire tree and then I had to undo it and get a new string of lights in colored because we like the white lights, like a classic Christmas, along with a little pop of color. And then I got started on my little display on top of the china hutch. I have been able to kind of transition through seasons with all the decorations and kind of decorate the top of it, which is really nice. It keeps everything away from the animals, so no cats are pulling on cords, they're not destroying any of the decorations, and the dog can't reach them. So it's the perfect spot for us right now, but I can't wait to decorate a bit more and cover a few more surfaces in our next house when we get there. I have bought a few Christmas decorations for myself to kind of add to my collection over the years, but a lot of it is actually stuff that has been handed down from my mom or my grandma or Jason's grandma or family. So it's really nice to be able to use pieces and decorations that there's some history and there's story and memories behind versus just buying it all brand new, which there's nothing wrong with that, but we're lucky enough to be able to have things that our family has given us. Like I said, it was a quick video today, but I want to wish everyone a happy holiday season and I hope you all stay safe and healthy.